Hi guys! Alright, I am here for Sophie's two month update. I cannot believe it. I feel like I filmed her one month update just yesterday. Um, so that's I guess the first thing I can say. It goes by really quickly. I know everybody says that and they're right. It goes by really really quickly. Um, so to start out with um, her stats. Yesterday we had a doctor's appointment, her two month doctor's appointment, and at that appointment she weighed 11 pounds 8 ounces so when she was born she was 7 pounds 3 ounces so that's a little bit more than 4 pounds up from when she was born uh, she was 23 inches long when she was born she was 20 inches long so she has grown by 3 inches um, and she did really really well at her doctor's appointment um, let's see besides growth um, breastfeeding is still going really well she loves to eat I will say that um, uh, her eating is not always consistent, so um, she goes through, she has some days where um, she eats a ton, like she's basically, it just seems like that's all she wants to do all day is eat, 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 and then other days where she seems to want to sleep, and I think that that has to do with when she's growing, so she'll like bulk up, you know, like she, she um, will take a lot of milk, and then she'll go through a couple days where she's just sleeping all the time, probably growing, um, but she really does love breastfeeding, luckily, um, we didn't have any problems with it. She took to it right away. Um, I've never had problems with like sore nipples or anything like that. She's always had a pretty good latch. Um, my supply has been good, so I'm really grateful for that. Um, a little side note about breastfeeding, um, just her little breastfeeding personality that I want to include in this update. Um, just the sweet sounds that she makes when she's eating. Um, I don't know if all babies do this or if each baby has their own unique sounds they make when they're eating, but okay, first of all, um, when she's hungry and she wants to eat, as soon as I like get her ready and she's there, she does the cutest little excited cough cry thing, I call it. Um, she goes like, <coughs> like she's really excited to eat and it's got like a little cough sound in it. And then when she's actually eating and she's latched on and the milk is flowing, she makes this like, mm, mm, like little sweet little baby sounds. And I'll try to, to get a clip of her doing that and I'll insert that so that you can hear that. <coughs> Um, but just one of the things I want to make sure I remember for the future is just all the sweet little sounds she makes when she's eating. Just that sweet little baby sound. In terms of things that she's doing now that she's two months, she seems to be doing a lot. Like a lot more than when she was at one month. So one of the things she does a lot now is smile. Um, she's been smiling. The first time I saw her like smile at me was when she was three weeks old. But I mean now she really smiles. Like she does a lot of she does a lot of social smiling. Like when her dad comes home from work and he in um he comes in and he'll say hi to her, she looks at him and she does this big grin. And of course, whenever I look at her, you know, anytime you talk to her, she'll smile. I was out um shopping with her today and I had her in my boba carrier and a stranger came up and smiled at her and she smiled back, so she even smiled at the stranger. So she's definitely smiling a lot. She um, kicks her legs around a lot. You know, she's she seems to be getting um, really strong. She moves around. Um, she holds her head up really well, so I can now hold her like this. And you see how she, she just holds up her head now. So of course, when she was newborn, she couldn't do that at all, and you had to like, you know, always do this. But now she just holds herself up and seems really sturdy. Um, she does pretty well with tummy time, although she doesn't like it. So she'll she'll um, she'll do it for a couple minutes before she starts fussing. But she's good at it. And what I mean by that is she actually you know she lifts up her head and she'll push herself up just a little bit. I mean hardly, but she pushes herself up just a little bit. Um, what else does she do? She has um, found her hands. She loves sucking on her hands. Uh, and so far, she's only gotten her thumb in her mouth once. but she definitely loves sucking on her fist. She makes a fist like this, and she puts her mouth over kind of like her whole fist right there and sucks on it. So um, when she's going to sleep for a nap, I'll hear her like sucking on her fist. So she self-soothes by sucking on her fist. Um, she's cooing. She talks to me. So if I lay her down on her changing table and I talk to her, she, uh, uh, she makes those sounds back at me, um, which is really sweet. 
And look at her. I mean, like you see, she's just really alert and she looks around at everything. She's the kind of baby that um, likes to sleep in silence. She does not sleep well with commotion. She wants it to be dark and quiet. And as soon as there's commotion or talking, she wants to know what's going on. She opens her eyes and she looks around and um, just wants to see what's up. So she's definitely not the kind of baby that sleeps well through commotion. Um, she is sleeping through the night. She is awesome that way that she sleeps through the night, but she does not do well on her own. So she still, um, I mentioned this in her one month update that she hates to be put down and that's, that's the same now as it was then. She just wants to be held all the time, but as long as she's with me, she sleeps through the night now. So, um, well, a good night, I'll say she's down for the night at 1030. Like we're both in bed and sleeping at 1030 and then she'll sort of start stirring around 330 or four. Um, it doesn't wake up fully, but she'll start kind of squirming and it wakes me up and so then I'll, I'll feed her and she kind of sleepily eats for like five minutes and then she's passed out again. But I mean, she doesn't even open her eyes. So she'll, she'll like kind of keep her eyes closed, but she eats for like five minutes and then it's back to sleep again until about 630 in the morning. So I'm really happy about that, that I'm getting great sleep because of it. And then during the day, um, on some days she, she naps well, and then on other days she doesn't. Like I mentioned in the beginning of the update, on some days she just wants to eat all day. But on the days where she sleeps well, I'd say she takes a two or three hour nap in the morning, and then another two or three hour nap in the afternoon. And then she'll also go, go for like a one hour snooze from like seven to eight in the evening. And then she goes to sleep with us around 10, 10.30. Well, I, I start the routine at like 9.30 and then she's asleep by 10.30. Um, so yeah, sleep is pretty good. And um, But again, the caveat there is that you, somebody has to be holding her. So um, as long as you're holding her, she's fine. Um, besides that, let's see. I want to make sure that I'm not forgetting anything. She's still in cloth diapers. I recently did a um, newborn cloth diaper review. Um, where I talk about how that's been going for us and if you're interested in that I'll link that video down below so that you can check it out um, but yeah if you guys have any specific questions leave those down below or if you want me to do um, a video all about breastfeeding um, I can do that if you want to know how um, I guess I can just really quickly say my blood sugars as far as the breastfeeding goes my blood sugars have sort of evened out and I feel like I'm, it's pretty similar to how it was before I got pregnant. So in terms of um, blood sugars, um, now at her two month point, um, I'd say my blood sugars are back to normal. Um, that being said, they're still very good. Like I'm keeping them in a really tight range because I am breastfeeding and I don't want them to get too high. Um, just I've heard mixed things. Some doctors say it's not an issue if you have high blood sugars when you breastfeed, but just for me, it feels weird to like feed her when my blood sugars Hi. Um, so yeah, my blood sugars have been pretty good and yeah, if you want me to, to go into anything in detail more, um, let me know in the comments. But that is Sophie's two month update and I just want to make sure that I have her on camera so that I can remember her size, remember how big she was at two months. I mean, she feels huge to me. A friend of ours, uh, they just had a baby two and a half weeks ago and they just came over to the house to show us their baby and their baby is right now weighs seven pounds 14 ounces and he looked tiny I can't believe that she was ever that small but I mean she was that small but I can't believe it because she just feels so much bigger now but yep that's her that's two months all right Sophie good job all right I'll see you guys <laughs> you're gonna get a smile you like kisses from mommy um all right, guys, I will see you in my next video. Bye.